I can't believe I'm back here, but uh, it feels good to see these guys again. <laughs> They really haven't cleaned this place up at all. Oh, hey! Hey, you were looking for Michael, right? Well, guess what? We found him! He just left, uh... I don't think too long ago. He said he was going back to him. You know, you're like... You're good at this. You, you're good at, um... Apocalypses... This. Stop, stop. You're making me blush. But I'm... <laughs> hey, I'm not. Roxy and me, staying out of trouble is like a full-time job, man. I've only ever been really good at one thing, and I barely even do it anymore. Gods and Whiskey is still something to be proud of. You were the soundtrack of my teenage years. Ow. Really that old? And exactly. Like, what have we done lately? I gotta find that spark again, man. Get back in touch with the gods instead of just the whiskey. Oh, Farouk. Gesundheit. Farouk's our producer. He lives next door down a hill, like, totally obsessive about discographies. Collects every master tape and unreleased track you could imagine, including ours. Hey, some of those have real promise. I wonder if... maybe sample them? Hey, I I'll be right back, man. Tell Roxy not to worry. Right back? You're not thinking of going out there for feckin' master tapes. I know you're not. I'm not? You're not good at apocalypsing, remember? I'll get your tapes. For one thing, being responsible for a new G&W album would mean bragging rights forever. Oh, kick ass! If Farouk's not home, just ask his boyfriend Dave to show you around. Tell him I sent you. If either of them are still there and alive, sure. You know, if you want to get us a reward, we're running a little low on potato chips. The cheesy ones. Ah, I would, boy. But I have terrible news for you. The zombies have developed an unnatural hunger for cheesy chips. Even more than for human flesh. They've eaten them all. Oh, for real? Those assholes. End of the world. Never. Bet I could hoist myself up onto that French yep, riot and style. Hopefully they won't even notice me. Get up! Okay, they did notice me, but at least they didn't make it. There we go. <laughs> Kinda did save me. Sorry, Dave. You weren't much of a bouncer. I'll just let myself in. No. The best clubs are always the hardest ones to get into. Now. Let's see if the DJ has these old G&W tracks. Oh, 
Oh no, not the dagger. I really like this one. I know you also have a similar one. It's just right. the dying light. Master tape number one. Hope I get to listen to some of these last tunes. Choices? My finely tuned feminine instinct for decor tells me so. So where do I have to go now? Oof. Safety in numbers does nothing against just one little zombie nibble. Oh well, time for a jam. And burn. <laughs> okay, didn't burn, but so good enough. Hey, Duke and Excellence is on this one. Proper old school party track, that is. Thanks for the money, dead people. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just passing by. That's a big one. <laughs> Yeah, they really are trying to get in. Ricky, me boy, the roving music historian has returned. Oh, hey, I don't remember calling a... Do we have an interview scheduled? An interview? No, you rampant waste of oxygen. I'm back from having... At great personal risk, mind. Recovered your stupid master tapes from your stupid producer's undead house party. Farouk's? Oh, man. Dave's gonna be, like, heartbroken. On which note, I bear startlingly similar news. Oh, sad note, man. Like, ballad-worthy. There was this one track we laid down and... Hey, wait. D did you say master tapes? I was just thinking about getting those back. What an unexpected coincidence. 
This is fucking awesome, man. I'm gonna listen to them right away. I... Oh, there's some gems on here, you know? Some real gems. I... Uh, I think. Hey, thanks. You're like a guardian angel of rock. I suppose that's something to put on me business cards. Thank <laughs> you.